This is Fan First Network. Anytime that the Celtics are in town or you go to Boston and you're a team like the current Raptors and you bring it to a close game, you kind of got to be happy about it. It's a loss and you really shouldn't be happy about a loss. But given the current state of this Raptors team, how they're on a turnaround, new coach, new guys, new rotation, new systems, that's a pretty impressive game, especially when you're missing OG. Going up against guys like Jason Tatum, Jalen Brown. You know, we have Tingus Pingus out there too, Chris Asporzingis. And he was he was balling a little bit too. But also I want to talk about the in-season tournament in a whole. I think it's brilliant. Dennis Schroeder earlier today, he had those thoughts. He was like, you know what, this is good. From Germany, he knows what it's like. DFB Pokal in the Bundesliga. He knows what it's like, man. He knows what this in-season tournament is like and what it does. It brings in views. It's something for these guys to fight for early in the season instead of having that typical fan that goes like, oh, it doesn't matter to the playoffs. Come back to me when they win a playoff series. The playoffs. Like, that's, that's, bro, it's a problem when 82, 82 games don't matter. It's a problem when people just throw away the entire season, and it's bad for the league. The in-season tournament gives people something, some, some kind of prize. Some kind of prize to just just win and just set aside those people like oh, playoffs the entire time. You just like box score watch and just wait to the postseason. It's crazy. The court, gorgeous, best one in the league. Some teams just trying to do too much. You have like looking like the Teletubbies out there. You have the Power Ranger courts. It's ridiculous. Keep it simple, stupid. Is what my dad tells me my entire life. Don't complicate things. This is Fan First Network.